bird on a tree I'm just sitting here I got time It's clear to see From up here The world seems small We can sit together It's so beautiful You and me We're meant to be In the great outdoor Forever free Hey guys, welcome to Home Over the Road. Kenny here. Thanks for tuning in. I'm going to take this opportunity uh, that I got a few minutes sitting at the truck stop to, to go through my truck real quick and show you how I got it set up to, to stay comfortable for the you know the extended periods I stay out on the road. I got a small truck, mid-rise uh, 2015 uh, International Pro Star, and uh, it's just got a regular sleeper on it, but I got it packed full of stuff, and let me show you how I got it how I get it done. Um, right here over my seat, this is where you know where I'm at all the time. Obviously, GPS, Qualcomm, phone mount, CB. Here's my cold weather gear. Here's my um, Overalls, just so I can, when I'm tarping, I don't get filthy. Hard hat, reflective vest, gloves, toboggans, that kind of stuff. Right above me here, you know, toilet paper in case I need to blow my nose, sanitary wipes, uh, I mean, um, hand sanitizer, stuff to clean my glasses with, flashlights, all that kind of stuff right here where I can grab it when I, when I want to get out um, in a hurry. I gotta go through my truck, paper towels, tripods, that kind of stuff for my camera gear, medicine uh, cabinet, that's pretty self-explanatory. Uh, these are bags that I keep folded up up here so when I get in and out of my truck I can throw stuff in them like when I go home this is what I throw my you know whatever I'm going to wear at home because I'm only going to be there for a couple days I grab that and get out of there this is my little cleaning area that keeps uh, all my sanitary uh, products up here cologne whatever body body sprays mouthwash toothpaste toothbrush this is my station where I keep all my extra razor soap all of that kind of stuff this is where I brush my teeth in the morning and um Everything I need is right there. I need to clean that mirror. Um, coffee station, protein shakes in the mornings, fish oil, that kind of stuff. This this little thing right here sits right inside of there. That's where I do my shakes. Obviously food and my container here, cappuccino, that kind of stuff, food, a lot of fish. Extra, uh, my big bottles of shampoo, conditioner, body, uh, body wash and all that's up there. I fill up my little travel size ones and they go in that bag right there. That's my shower bag. Uh, right here is Stokes. This is where I keep my fork and spoon that I use all the time. And I just wipe them when I get done. I wipe them off with the disinfectant wipes and uh, that keeps them clean. That's the top to my little um, uh, uh, blender there. All right here, this is where I keep the, my glass that I that I uh, heat water in. Always heat water in a microwave. If you're going to heat water in your microwave, do it in a glass container. Don't do it in a plastic container. You're going to get a lot of xenoestrogens that are bad for you. This is just all cooking stuff. Cooking and, and bowls. This is my skillet, my crock pot, all of the stuff that I need to cook in there, you know, including the utensils like spatula, big spoons, all of that stuff's in there. I even got some extra coffee in there. This is just uh, electronic stuff wiring and all of that kind of stuff phone chargers and all of that, that that might need to be extra the drawer you got at your house that you throw everything in it just in case you need that's what this is extra towels uh towels and washcloths in case i need to get cleaned up in the truck or if the uh if the uh, truck stop doesn't have them then i've got them clothes that's pretty self-explanatory emergency bucket there's my ab wheel on top of that hadn't you had to use that emergency bucket but i figured i better have one just in case i was somewhere where there was no bathroom you can double bag that I even put pad on the top because i never had to use it but if I need it, it's there. This is my workout uh, sweatsuit right here. I keep it all in there. Just got all my laundry done. I'll probably wear that three, four times and work out in the cold like that. Wash it, put it back in there. And then, you know, the visor for my front windshield. And uh, here's just my earbuds and my uh, wireless keyboard for my laptop. More food over here. This is also where I keep my um, paper towels and toilet paper and all that. I, I like to have plenty of that. This is just fruit. Be uh, uh, breakfast stuff mainly my extra protein i keep plenty of that in here because i do, do take a lot of protein supplements and uh now i get to the stuff that it really i think is is kind of helps me live in here uh obviously i love having my guitar i had a 32 inch tv over there got rid of it um never watched it i'd rather have my guitar i got my jacket my hats under there 
there's my uh, phone mount. If I do want to watch YouTube or something while I'm laying down, I can just do it on my phone. You know, I, I, I keep plenty of pillows under there. Um, let me kick it back from over here. This is seven gallons of water from, from the house. Uh, that's the extra water that I bring. Even my trash can, it's got uh, Velcro on the bottom, so it's Velcro to the carpet. It doesn't, you know, move around or whatever. Have a mini fridge right here is my big table that right there slides right out of there i can fold it out right here cook on it whatever i need to do my mini fridge i keep a gallon of milk in there uh about four or five cartons of eggs top is just mainly ice uh i do keep some frozen like chicken and stuff like in there on the weekends when i'm resetting i will break out my skillet and uh cook up some chicken or steak or whatever i don't cook like that every day i normally just do fish microwave on top like i said that's just where i uh basically i boil water that's pretty much all i use it for if you microwave to reheat you're pretty much destroying the nutritional value of the food so you know i don't do that too much all that stuff you saw up top is held in place by bungee cords and i've got those crisscrossing all under here now like i said i've got seven gallons of water there but i also have uh five gallons of water right here on tap and what i do is i slide that right out and push, turn the thing off so i've got water on tap right there five gallons i keep that full behind the seat right here like i said i just did my laundry but um i don't know if you can let's see yeah here you go i've got my laundry bag and it's hanging from up there so i just throw my clothes in there there's my little closet here is my I, I mounted this it's my uh little vac that i use i use that constantly to keep my to keep my truck clean uh back there underneath there 3000 watt inverter um that's how i run everything everything's always plugged in there's my laptop i keep it you know right here tucked down beside me so i can pop it up i also have another little computer table right there in the closet and i can pull that one out use it for my computer just use it to eat it folds up and puts away a lot of times i'll use that but um that's pretty much you know the 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 big stuff that i keep in here everything you see up there is bungeed in and I love this truck because instead of you know a lot of guys have that bunk or they don't want the bunker they keep it folded up i use it for storage up there everything's velcroed or bungeed in so you know it doesn't move when i'm driving down the road and it allows me to live very comfortably in the truck if anybody has any questions um about how i set this stuff up or you know how i got all of this in here just uh just you know uh comment below and um i'd be happy to talk to you about uh you know where i bought stuff or whatever what kind of stuff i use exactly how how i set up the inverter and all that jesus loves you so do i it's clear to see from up here the world seems small we can sit together it's so beautiful you and me meant to be in the great outdoors forever free